Welcome to the spoken tutorial on more on grep. In this tutorial we will learn some more on grep command through some examples. To record this tutorial I am using Linux operating system GNU bash version 4.2.24. Please note GNU bash version 4 or above is recommended to practice this tutorial. As prerequisites you should know basics of Linux terminal. You should be aware of grep. For relevant tutorials, please visit our website which is as shown. We can match more than one patterns as well. Then we have to use the hyphen E option. I will use the same file grepdemo.txt. Say we want to find information for those who are either in civil or electronics. We need to type on the terminal grep space hyphen e space within double quotes electronics after the quote space hyphen e space within double quote civil after the quote space grep demo dot txt. Press enter. The output is displayed. Say you need to look into people whose title is Chaudhary. The problem is different people spell their titles in different ways. So what is the solution? In such cases we can use hyphen E option with hyphen I. Type grep space hyphen I E space within double quotes Chaudhary C H A U D H U R Y after the quote space hyphen I E space within double quotes C H O W D H A R I after the quote space grep demo dot txt press enter the output is displayed but there can be many other ways in which we can write the names how many hyphen E options can we give obviously there needs to be a better way and that way is through regular expressions. A regular expression provides a concise and flexible means for matching strings of text such as particular characters, words or patterns of characters. There are a number of regular expression characters. Let us see them one by one. The character class it allows us to specify a group of characters within a pair of square brackets. Only one out of this group of characters is matched. Example, A, B, C would mean that this regular expression matches either A or B or C. To match Chaudhary, we may type at prompt grep space hyphen I space within double quotes ch opening square bracket ao closing square bracket opening square bracket uw closing square bracket dh opening square bracket ua closing square bracket r opening square bracket yi closing square bracket after the double quote space grep demo dot txt press enter the output is displayed. It still does not match Chaudhary with double E. If we want to specify a large range then we write first letter dash last letter of the range. Suppose we like to match any digit we simply write 0 to 9. One out of this group of characters is matched. The asterisk the asterisk refers to zero or more occurrences of the immediately preceding character. For example, AB asterisk can match A, AB, ABB and ABBB etc. So to match the student's name whose name is Mira, we type at the prompt grep space hyphen I space within double quotes M opening square bracket EI closing square bracket 
asterisk r a a asterisk after the quotes space grep demo dot txt press enter the output is displayed the dot regular expression matches any one character say we want to search any words that are four letters long and starts with m we would simply type grep space within double quotes m dot 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 space after the quote space grep demo dot txt press enter the output is displayed here the space within the quote is important as it would match five or more letter words we may be specific about where in the line we want to search for our pattern it may be at the beginning of the line for that we have the caret sign now if we want to get those entries whose roll number starts with a we know that roll is the first field in the file we type at the prompt grep space within double quotes caret sign a after the quotes grep demo dot txt press enter the output is displayed similarly to match a pattern at the end of the file we have the dollar sign to find stipends between 7000 to 8999 we have to write grep space within double quotes opening square bracket 78 closing square bracket dot 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 dollar sign after the quote space grep demo dot txt press enter the output is displayed this brings us to the end of this tutorial let us summarize in this tutorial we learn to match more than one pattern to check a word that has different spelling character class the use of asterisk to match any one character using dot to match a pattern at the beginning of the file to match a pattern at the end of the file as an assignment list those entries that are five letters long and starts with y watch the video available at the link shown below it summarizes the spoken tutorial project if you do not have good bandwidth you can download and watch it the spoken tutorial project team conducts workshops using spoken tutorials gives certificates to those who pass an online test for more details please write to contact at spoken-tutorial.org spoken tutorial project is a part of the talk to a teacher project it is supported by the national mission on education through ict mhrd government of india more information on this mission is available at the link shown below the script has been contributed by anirban and sachin this is ashwini patel from iit bombay signing off thank you for joining